Hey guys, how's it going? Um, so, I just got done making a video of running the steel and echo equipment. As you can see, I put them all away, except for the backpack blowers. But if we just go over here, as you can see I put them all back. Um, so I'm making this video um, of something very special, actually. And you're about to see it in a few seconds. That's right, everybody. I got, I recently gotten this lawnmower. It's a Honda HR214. Now, I can't quite date this this particular one because there's supposed to be a sticker right here on the um, with the serial number, so I'm not exactly sure. Um, much about this one because I really can't get much information on this particular model without that so because there are so many different versions of the HR214 so I'm not exactly sure what not exactly sure which um, what year this one is but I'm just gonna take a guess I'm just gonna guess 1985 I'm gonna say um, and I also got um, I also got a bag for it too, which is pretty cool, but I don't have it here at the moment. Um, but it is a really nice lawnmower, and I got it running yesterday. I put, I swapped ignition coils out because I got two. Um, the seller included two of these. He included another um, one, but that one wasn't running. This one wasn't running, so I swapped ignition coils and I cleaned the carburetor um, and the spark plug on this one. And I got it running. So yeah. And, um, well, I, I really like this lawnmower because it's all metal, as you can see. Even the top is metal. The only thing, um, that's plastic on here is the air filter box, but it's actually a good quality plastic, though. And also this bag, um, also this bag door here is metal, too, as you can see. Yeah, and you do have two options for the self-propelled system, and I got a bee flying around me right now. That's why I'm kind of moving. To, um, that's why I was kind of not moving there. But anyway, so um, you have two options. You have speed number one, or you could bring it down to speed number two. Um, however, um, I. I think that the self-propelled system is a little too fast. I'm thinking I'm going to have to adjust it, um, which you can do by, um, I think you adjust it by one of these cables here. I can't, I'm not exactly sure which one. I think it's this one here. I think you can adjust that. I'm not exactly sure. Um, sure, I'll have to check on that. But anyway, you get a, this does have a clutch on it, so to use it, um, push this back here and that will activate the blades. And um, press this bar down with it. It actually, that's the self-propelled, it's a rear wheel um, drive self-propelled. And um, also, if I tilt it back, as you can see that blade looks practically brand new so that was pretty cool there and also you can see there's the clutch there and this thing is heavy obviously but it's really good quality it's a nice lawnmower and since it's a honda um it's made in japan which is very nice so, um and now there's not much more to say about it except Oh yeah, these aren't the original wheels, I'm pretty sure, but what I like about these wheels is that they have a grease port, as you can see here, so you can actually, so you can grease, um, so you can put a grease gun on and grease them up. It has an all four wheels, which I actually plan on doing that. So, with that being said, let's start her up. Um, but first, to start one of these, you put it on, um, when it's a cold start, you put it on choke, um, and then once it starts, you put it on 
high and then if um, if you wanted to stop the lawnmower um, you could put it on low which is idle so that's pretty cool then to shut it off you just put it all the way down to stop and if if it's a warm start like if it had if it, um, if it was running not too long ago you can actually put the choke on high and that will um, that's basically for if it was a warm start so yeah um, anyway that being said it's on choke now let's start her up all right so hopefully you can see that Hang on a second there we go that's good that should work all right here we go As you can see there cuts very well so for the lawn cutting video on coming up this weekend I'll definitely try, um, use this lawnmower here try it out and as, as well as the PB 500T and the FS 56 trimmer um, so stay tuned for the lawn cutting video but anyway there was just thought I would show you guys my new lawnmower this is by far my best lawnmower investment, so pretty cool. So um, remember to comment and subscribe, and thanks for watching.